welcome to our newscast here at TV 13, WEAU Eau Claire. Wait a minute. Thank you for turning in. I'm Eric J. You no, know, I don't look nearly as Otherwise bad. Otherwise known as Rusty. Uh, with me today is Melanie Flint. Yeah. Hi, Melanie. And... Be Melanie J, hopefully. And, and, oh. Wow. And me, Andre Ray. <laughs> and Hammer. Hammer. Don't your hands, dude. Uh, okay. I always look like this. Really? Yeah. I don't like you making fun of it either. Wow. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, retail pork prices continue to drop, as it seems that there are less women out there who want to be porked. What? What it what says. Do you mean, eh? Did you get that on your own, or what? Well, the pork prices continue to drop. Oh, wait, no, this is all about prostitution. Pork prices continue to drop. Okay, so it's a little bit less to pork In Eau Claire? Somewhere. In Eau Claire, apparently so. Where? Hey, cost of living here is cheap. Okay, Andre, what do you got? Well... Uh. Anyway. Anyway, yeah, what's the uh, story about your phone sex? Okay, I suppose. So I called him on my cell phone because I was like, I don't want him to be able to trace this number, you know? Although you could probably trace cell phones, too. Uh. You, so I had a $60 call on my cell phone <laughs> from this guy and uh, our experience into the land of phone sex. Okay, let's get to the good stuff. Did anybody cream? Cream? <laughs> As in, like, where are you going? I don't know, when people say that word, I have a tendency to back away. Cream's a good word. I think it's appropriate. I, I think okay. it's disgusting, to be honest, and I think you're a bunch of sexist pigs. <laughs> Why do you say that? You, okay, you're one to talk. This story. <laughs> What's up? Yeah. Okay, who just got done talking about phone sex? Yeah. The skinniest employee that would either be, be Rob, Rob or, or Bussy. You. Oh, not me, dude. I ain't skinny, dude. Yeah. Look skinny. Today's act brief, health concerns because some were suspected in recent food safety, what? Okay. Last month ranked as... In Ag News, an Iowa insurance company is distincting a product it says could protect livestock farmers against drops in market prices. The proposed policy of American Ag... Ag... Uh, Ag insurance... Policy. Thank you. Would let a farmer insure a heart... He, yeah. Okay, Andre, thank you for interrupting me. Technology is so art. So, tonight it'll be 30 and rainy. Click. <laughs> Tomorrow will be 70. Click. And you see the ISO bars and mesoscale clippers are rolling. And what are the good. ISO bars exactly? I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Last whatever. month ranked as the third safest in January on Wisconsin roads and highways for the later half of the century. Excuse me. Sorry. According to preliminary information from the Wisconsin Department of Transportation, 35 people died in traffic crashes last month, which is good for you and me because we're living. That means there's 35 less people on this earth to take up our air. Andre? I saw South Park last night. It was great. I hate you. I like Leo now. <laughs> I like Leo. You're a Leo? What? No. My leg's been open like I that the whole time. Oh, uh, so our latest story about Tom leaving Hagen is that he is crazy. Yes. And he is loony, and he is not normal. Right. Okay. Just to reiterate, and let our viewers know how, please be careful. We can't stress entering. this enough. If you see Tom leaving Hagen, run the other way. Don't walk. He works. Run. And he works here. <laughs> After big losses yesterday, here's a look at the numbers on Wall Street. Uh, we don't have the numbers there. All right, what's your name? My name's Eric. Oh. The numbers are somewhere in between one and one million. Well. We're out of time. Another busy weekend ahead for us here at TV 13. Coming up tomorrow, highlights from the Blue Golds and Stout, the Sabres and Gophers, or the, the Badgers and Gophers. Sunday night, the Packers battle the Bucks for Bob Gallagher. I'm Chris Earl. Have a great weekend. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs>